Everybody, welcome back. Falcon, Neo Scavenger, Mighty Mod of Doom. Let's continue the game here, shall we? Last episode, we ended up with this Martha's... whatever army dude here trying to fight me. <clears throat> he offered to uh, cease fire, which is kind of weird. <clears throat> you know what's kind of weird? Me losing my voice. That's kind of weird, too. Um, apparently, I'm going through puberty just now. Um, he wants to... he offered to cease fire, which is kind of weird because they never normally do that to my knowledge. So let me end my turn here. I'll probably end up having to fight him again. No, he ran off. I'm not sure what this guy's problem is, but I guess he doesn't want to fight. But I do want to fight, so... Fuck you. I am going to fight you. So let's search for him, number one. There he is. He's only four away from me. Um, I'm going to advance one. He wants to cease fire. No, that's not going to work out for me, my friend. <clears throat> so here we go. We're two away. Let's go for a melee attack. Uh, we whipped his um, left leg with a crowbar. <clears throat> Um, player attacks, so we whipped his left leg with a crowbar. He offers to talk with the player, and he's, uh, temporarily distracted. Perfect. So, I'm sorry, my friend. We're not gonna talk for shit. I'm gonna fight you. Player demolished Martha's, uh, Martha Army Soldier's upper left arm with a crowbar. Martha's Army Soldier left arm has been crippled. He's stunned and unable to move for a moment. Excellent. So, he's still two away. So, I will just kind of, um, melee attack him again. And now, I crippled his right arm, so both of his arms are fucked now, and he's bleeding. Okay, so let's go for another swing. And I hit. Player pounds the upper left arm with a crowbar. <laughs> I really want to fucking get rid of this guy's arms, apparently. Let me try it again. Player wailed on a Marta army soldier left arm with a crowbar. He's in severe pain, is having trouble concentrating, and now he's bleeding. Is he, um, stunned severe pain? He's still standing, oddly enough, though, so I gotta give him that. Let's create an obstacle really quickly. Um, he needs a moment to recover. Lower chest was scratched, and he is, um, still up. Oddly enough. Alrighty. Let's do a melee surge and see what happens. We pretty much decimated him. But now we're really tired, but that's okay. I just wanted to check this dude out here and see if he had anything of use. Probably not, but gray shirt, brown suit pants. Yeah, this guy had absolutely nothing worth the value, so I just wanted to fight him just for the hell of it. But he does have some edible berries, which I will indeed eat. You know, I'm gonna kill you and then eat your food. <laughs> I'm just an asshole that way. Let's eat this, and he's got some ketchup as well. Uh, he's some ketchup. And stack up the rest of it. Alright, there you go. So, um, that's it. I killed him just for the hell of it. I'm not gonna do much with his body anyway, so... I mean, not anything I could show on camera if you catch my drift. That's a joke. I would never do that. That's just really disturbing, actually. So let's continue going forward. End my turn here. I need to get some rest really soon. Hopefully we could probably get some rest in this little city here. Let's scavenge about. Abandoned apartment building. We should be able to rest in there. And ooh, this will kind of help us out the healing. Oh, yes! More whiskey! <laughs> this is not only the alcoholic in me talking, but the fact that it's really useful for, you know, healing um, cuts and things of that nature. So, let me really quickly... Mm, two and two, huh? Eh, you know, we're kind, of, we're kind of thirsty anyway, so let's just, uh, drink this water. Okay, and then put this in that. There you go. So our thirst is now good. <clears throat> we have a few more bottles here if we wanted to take those, but really don't want to. Broken bottle, yep, I know how to make that. Sneaker left. And a box from an old Red Cross, uh, aid purse, though. That's interesting. Now, mind you, if we were trying to build the box cut ourselves, we already have the two boxes needed, but, unfortunately... We can't, because I think you need, you need the mechanical skill for that, which I do not have. So this will help us out in terms of sleeping here tonight, so we'll keep that in mind. Let me end my turn here really quickly. I'm really wary now. My clean rags have fallen apart. What's that from? My injury, maybe? <clears throat> Dirty rags. That's still minor cut, minor pain, so let's go and wrap this up again. There you go. Now, should we take the precaution here and use some alcohol in this cut? I don't think we do. Our immune system and pain tolerance seems to be up there, and our blood supply is pretty good. So I don't, I don't think we need it, necessarily. I was kind of worried that we caught an infection from that saber tooth tiger, but it doesn't seem like we did. So really quickly here, I just need to scavenge a few more times and then just try to get some sleep. There's a storage shed. We'll use this. No useful items were found. All right. So now we definitely go into trying to get some sleep here. So, let's toss, um, where, where are we going to sleep? Uh, this one. Seems better. 
That's bet this one has more shelter and healing though, but yeah, we'll do this one. So we do or Yeah, you know what, let's just do that one. <laughs> I know I switched my mind a few times here, but just to make sure I'm getting the right way. Plus, you know with this, the healing's gonna be up to almost green anyway, so we should be okay. We'll plus this down for the alertness, obviously, and now let's just try to get some rest, and hopefully it works out for us. Uh, come on, man. I need a really good rest right now. Like, you don't even know how much this is really important to me, so... Come on, game. Let me rest. That's not enough resting, goddammit! Come on. Uh-oh. <laughs> I thought something had gone down. Come on, come on, come on. It's nighttime, so I'm not going anywhere anyway. You know the routine at this point. I force it into it works. Oh, oh, well, you know, we're almost up to green, dude. Oh, we're overrested. You know, that's enough for me. Fuck it, I'll take it. So, I'll take it. Uh, we'll, you know what, just stay in the campsite there just in case we ever come back here for some reason or another. We'll take this with us and we're just thirsty at this point, but everything else is relatively okay. Good. Let's get the hell on out of here. And we're going to probably come and check this area out, I would say, right? Player is tired. Oh, come on. <laughs> I, just, I was just well rested like a fucking move ago. An abandoned warehouse. Let's check this out. And use this, and do we want to use strong? Not really. Uh oh. <gasps> Base god. Player's pushing a wheelbarrow that allows them to transport more weight equipment. Player cannot run in combat. <gasps> you know what? It's a really small one, but fuck it, man. It's something at this point. And you know what? It's actually putting me as an unburdened now, so that's really, really good. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm really happy about that. My meat is about to expire, so we gotta keep that into consideration, too. Now, what do we want to carry in the wheelbarrow? We need to put stuff in here that's not too important or crucial. Things that I won't be like, oh, fuck. Like, in case I have to, like, leave it and run away, I won't be too broken up about it. So, you know, just things of that nature. Um, I'm gonna say... Bob's br I don't even know what this is for, so I'm going to put that in there. Uh, meat's about to expire, so sure, we'll put this in there as well. And... Roadmap, I guess I could just kind of flip you around here for now. We'll put these veggies in there as well. And... I guess that's pretty much it for now, right? I mean, none of this is really too important up here. But, at the same time, I, I figure that... It's not like I have any stuff to really put in that card here for now, you know? But I guess I'll just put this here for now. We'll probably eat this before it expires too, by the way, because otherwise it was kind of like pointless. Alright, put this over here, and then that right there. Okay, so that works out for me. We'll probably, you know, toss this in here too. Might as well. Okay, so hey, that worked out for us pretty good. Let's check out over here, and we'll use um, lighter... That would be strong? Not really. I think lighter would be enough. Fairgrounds t-shirt. Cargo pants and uh, another boot. Left shoe. Minus 40 and this one is 4.2. So yeah, I'll hold on to mine. Glass jar. Don't think I really need that. Could probably carry this too, but <clears throat> I think I'll be fine without it. Alrighty, so that's fine. I like what would happen there. So... I have one more turn left. Let's just keep going down. Are we heading towards DMC? Kind of. Kind of. I mean, we're getting there, but I'm going to take my time to get there just because I want to scavenge along the way. Uh, speaking of scavenging, you might as well check this out. Maybe we'll find some water, berries, things of that nature. Poison berries, regular berries. We'll eat these, these, and these, and poisonous dead cap. Don't want any of that. All right. Let's jump over here. Oh! Hey, how you doing there, Pharaoh Dog? Let me just kind of come back over here for a second. Don't follow me, you motherfucker. <laughs> Nothing gives you that right. Open field, botany. Sterilized water. Definitely do want. How's our meat here doing? 11.2. Alrighty. Drink this and... Edible. Well, you know what? Let me just put these over here since they're edible. I'm gonna... I might as well just bring these along with me because I'm going to have to forcefully eat that meat soon, otherwise it's going to expire, so let's just do that. We'll take it along with us for now, come in through here, areas to check out, and turn feral dog, go away. Scavenge away already. Stored office building. We we'll use this and found some more of that detergent <laughs> that I just drank last time. Uh, I'll take this with me just in case. Actually, you know what? 
you're not too important, so you definitely could go over here. Water bottle, always important. Take this with me, and what the fuck is this? Hold up. I'm a little bit confused here. What is this? Electronic scrap. Um, you know what? Let's um, put you in here. Just because I'm not sure what your use is, but it might be useful. You never know. And we'll snack you over there. Okay, that's pretty good for now. Let's check out this other one over here. We'll use this. Oh, no, that's strong. Just the lighter's enough, and oh, another cell phone. Or a cell phone, I should say. Take this, sell it for, you know, some petty cash. Okay, got two more moves left. We're done over here, though, so let's go and check this one out. That's our turn ended here, and scavenge time. All right, so we have a few storage sheds. Luckily, none of them are locked, but it seems like they've all been pillaged beforehand, so I'm probably getting closer and closer to DMC that, because usually when you get closer to DMC, most of the places on the way have been completely pillaged. I'm really surprised that none of this is, um... <laughs> I found absolutely nothing in these. That's really surprising. Wow. All right. Well, that was a string of fucking bad luck right there. We'll end our turn here, then, and let's continue going forward. Player's thirsty. It's understandable. Scavenge about. Nothing was found. Apartment building. Alrighty. What is this? The fucking some other crew owned this area? Really? Okay. <laughs> I was about to say, if that had nothing to, I was going to be kind of really pissed off. For a second there, I had a little bit of a... I held my breath. I thought I was like Zeppelin in there for a second. But nope, not quite. But hey, you know what? It's more, um... Amoxicillin, I do believe. Am I right about that? Amoxicillin, indeed. And where is our amoxicillin? It's probably in the bag in there. So just place that in there. Another first aid kit. Eh, I'll just leave that behind. I don't think I really need it. Infected water. Don't want anything to do with that. I'm not going to really take that. And we'll definitely take the clean rags, though. So stock those bad boys up. Good. I'm getting tired again. Thirsty. The whole nine yards. Same old deal. Storage shed will... Not use strong, but... You know what? Let's use everything. We're gonna have to get some rest anyway. Oh, we found... Oh, ho, 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 ho. Alrighty. And here is what we were looking to do. So, here's what we're gonna do. You, my friend, are going to... Number one. Move over here. You're going to empty out what's in here. And boom. Boom. Make sure you're stacking it properly, right, game? Okay, that's good. And... Good. There you go. So what we're doing is, um, we're replacing the suitcase for this bad boy right here because it lets us carry more, and there you go. Ha ha ha! I am really, really happy with that find. As you could probably imagine. So, that's been done with now. This is water infected, I don't really care about that, but everything else kind of worked out pretty good here. So, I think that's our last scavenge. Do we have anything else to scavenge? I think there's probably one more area left, but we do need to get some rest soon. <clears throat> so, this will probably be the area that we try to get some rest. And let's just do everything. We're completely weary now. We found a tarp. I don't really care about that now that I have the high tonic, so I'll hold on to that instead. We have a cornicola plastic bottle. You know what? Sure. Might as well take it. Alright. And everything else seems relatively okay. So I think what we do here is try to get some rest, so... Come on over here, put you down. Good shelter, good healing, good alertness. I love it. Yeah, it's not as good as that one, right? Yeah, so this is definitely better. So we'll do this and just try to get some sleep here. Stranger woke up, player was so... While stealing water. Oh, this guy was stealing water around me? That's fine. This is a looter. I don't really care about him. I'm just going to offer to talk to him. Because he's just a looter. He's just here to loot. I mean, let me, let's do this. Let's destroy everything here so this guy could leave me the fuck alone. <clears throat> so. Alright, bro. See, there's no... Was there alcohol in that first aid kit? I'm going to be a little bit upset if there was. I really think there was. <laughs> I think there was. Oh, fuck me. That's terrible. Um, Let's break this down, too. All right, let me try to get some sleep again. Maybe now he'll leave me alone. There's nothing here, bro. Go scavenge somewhere away. I just want to sleep. Okay. Yeah, well, I'm tired, but, you know, it could be worse. So that's fine. I'll move forward with this state onward. 
And he didn't leave me alone, so at least he wasn't that much of a scumbag and tried to loot me while I went back to sleep. We are thirsty, though, and you know what? Speaking of thirst, um, one condition. This is going to probably put me really, really bad right now, isn't it? No, not really. This expires next turn, so, you know, we'll see us leave it behind. We only ended up using one, but that is kind of usually what happens with the cured dog meat. Now, feral dogs there, maybe doggo, dogmen will eat it. There is uh, the looter right there. I'll leave him alone because, you know, he left me alone at the very least, so. Now, is he going to fight that feral dog? Probably, so good luck to you, my friend. Um, <laughs> you're going to probably need it against that feral dog. They don't give up on you too easily. We'll scavenge about over here, crumbling apartment building. Bam. I almost feel like, you know, trying to get some sleep again, so we might as well just kind of exhaust ourselves. What do we find here? Nothing, nothing, nothing at all. Big surprise there. Let's check this one out. Come on, come on. Just give me one good one here. Eh, you know, not too bad. I guess I'll take you just for the selling purposes of it. And infected water and everything else is pretty much bullshit. I guess I'll probably grab a few more of these bottles. No reason not to. I really need to rearrange this. <laughs> Looking at this just bothers me so much, but... Oh well. Alrighty, we have one more move left. Uh, I'm really thirsty. And I'm really wary, so I need to get to somewhere I could kind of knock out. Maybe I should have just stayed there, huh? There's just so much activity here. Like, feral dogs, looters. It's like, fuck, I just want to get away and find like a... Relatively... Oh shit, dehydrated and weary. This is a problem now. Alrighty, let me come over here. Come on, don't don't fuck me over, dehydration. Um, okay, let's um get over here. We'll use this. Um, wash yourself with detergent. Oh, uh, sure. Ah, huh. you have to. Some <laughs> this is the first time this has happened. You have some detergent with you. You might as well try to use it to get rid of those pesky bugs infesting your body. It is a cleaning product, after all, isn't it? And so, you quickly strip all your clothes and pour a big portion of the detergent, which strongly smells of lavender, over your head. Jumping into the water, you immediately start rubbing the substance into your hair, hoping to avoid staying naked in the cold for too long. The chemical quickly produces enough foam to cover you completely, and while the effect of using it in cold water is not too impressive, it does a good enough job of removing the dirt off of you. Hopefully, it will remove all the parasites as well. After washing off the dirty foam from yourself, you quickly jump back into the dry land and grab your clothes, you're freezing, but the feeling of being clean is worth it. The concept of putting your old smelly clothes is suddenly disgusting, but you need them to dry in order to survive. Um, Parasite's place is still there, so I'm pretty sure that I already removed them. It's just still there because it doesn't clean off from your UI, if I'm right. So, let's use this again. Get some water off of here. Infected, infected, yeah, it's going to be a marshland, so it's going to not get... Like, I'm not going to be able to kind of, um, find regular water here because it's a marshland. So what I'm thinking we do, what I'm thinking we do is just try to light a fire here if we can. Let's leave. Confirm. Let's go into node recipes and we'll do a campfire lid. Yeah, sure. Use that. I don't give a shit. Clear it out. And now we'll go into infected water and... Oh, it's, this is sterilized. Oh, we do have some water on us, after all. But let me just try to get the infected water dealt with. Sterilized water, you come back. Okay, so this is good. It's infected, infected, and we just need the saucepan. And obviously the fire. And we will confirm that. Clear it out. A few more turns left, and that's sterilized, infected. Confirm, clear. Okay, now we're out of turns, which is fine, but now we have sterilized water here, so... Drink that. Drink that. Drink that. Sterilize, sterilize, and sterilize. God, I was worried there for a second, because we were really dehydrated. Weary is one thing, but dehydration, that's the other thing that could really fuck you over. So, let's end turn here. I'm gonna try to get some sleep in this little broken down building here if I can. Luckily, there's a town next to it, too. Destroyed office building. Mmm. What happened to my lighter out of curiosity? Handful of maggots. You could probably use this as a fish, you know what? So let me take this with me. Infected water. Huh. I guess we're gonna use need our lighter here. That's odd. Usually you use the lighter. Rotten floorboard. Your foot slips through a rotting floorboard causing you to trip. 
The scrapes and bruises will sting for a while, but thankfully it wasn't more serious. No useful items were found. How not serious? Oh, come on. God damn it. Alrighty, so let's really quickly wash this off. Okay. I really would have preferred if you gone inside the uh, whiskey bottle. <laughs> Just so I know where you're at. There you go. Alrighty, so that's disinfected. Let's wrap it up here. I said, wrap it up. Okay. And more of this, huh? Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay. Mm, mm hmm, mm hmm. We could probably take this in case we ever find something else to cure, so sure. Let me grab this as well. Other than that, I just need to get some rest right now, so let me end my turn. Oh, that's a DMC guard. Right, so we're close to DMC, are we? No, that guy's pretty far off from DMC, dude. Holy shit, that guy's way out here. Let's check this out. No useful items were found. Alrighty, we need to get some rest if we can, so... No places to sleep here. Fuck, that's a problem. Alright, let me jump into this town then, and we'll try to do it over here. Okay. And, oh, fuck. I gotta probably scavenge the areas first. Okay. My rags have fallen apart. Let's scavenge this area first. Abandoned building. Nothing to loot here, too. Can I get some rest here now? Nope. Are you kidding me? I can't sleep anywhere around here? That would be really fucking crazy, dude. No useful items again. Wow, you gotta be shitting me. Really? What the fuck? <laughs> this is ridiculous I can't sleep here, dude. Found a few items, but... Oh. Amoxicillin? Yeah, more amoxicillin. That's fine. We'll bring this along. More rags. That's cool, too. We're getting quite a few cuts anyway recently. Sterilized water. I will drink. Painkillers and more nonsense. Alrighty. Well, let's just put you over here with this stack. And that's about it. Scavenge this last one. I'm not going to use anything. Busted my knuckles up, of course. A <laughs> fucking course. Um, has this been healed up? Minor cut, minor pain still? Alrighty. Um, let's see if we can get some rest. Yep, nowhere. We have to sleep here, though, because... Um, I'm not sure where else to go before passing out. So yeah, let's try to risk it. It's going to be kind of risky, but it is what it is. Toss you over here. And no shelter whatsoever. Alrighty. Let's give it a try. Alrighty. Had trouble falling asleep. It's raining. Just sleeping over here under the rain. Don't worry. Just make sure not to open your mouth or else you might drown. And that's not a good idea. <laughs> Last thing I need is to die drowning in my sleep. Alrighty. I'm getting some rest. Getting some rest, though. Alrighty. Cool. I'll take it. That's more than enough. I mean... It's never well rested, but it's something. So we'll take this and place you over here. Now let's get the fuck out of here. So pretty good. Let me actually call it an episode here. Got a little bit of progress done. Where's DMC at? Okay. So DMC isn't too far off. We're still trying to head ourselves over there, but so far so good. We found the wheelbarrow, which actually helped out a lot. So, you know, let's just keep going forward. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it so far. Uh, I'm scared. I'm not entirely sure where there's some other plot locations. I really don't want to look up the information in the mod. So, but I would like to kind of hit up the extra story mod locations that Zenic has added, but we'll see how that goes. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, I encourage you to leave a thumbs up, leave a like. The support does mean a lot. Other than that, I will catch you next time.